Hey there, everyone. Holy crap. We finally got word on offensive tackle Riley Reef. Yeah, Riley Reef. Who is he? Well, he was offensive tackle for the Minnesota Vikings, but he was drafted by Detroit Lions back in 2012. Then he moved on to Minnesota Vikings. This guy, this guy worked with... Ma Worked with Matthew Stafford and Kirk Cousins. And now he's going to be... The next QB he's protecting is Joe Burrow. Yep, he's agreed to terms with the Cincinnati Bengals. Yep, the Bengals are getting Riley Reef to protect Joe Burrow. It is one of the biggest news of them, all, of them all. I mean, seriously. But can Riley Reef even protect Joe Burrow? Sure, he's done a great job with Matthew Stafford and Kirk Cousins, but still... The Bengals, they do have a tendency to fall apart nowadays, but still. Plus, they're in the running for Penny so, so well from Oregon. But I think getting Riley Reef is a perfect way to protect Joe Burrow, especially since he's going to be in his sophomore year. Year. He's played, Riley Reef has played 120 games and only, and he didn't start in eight of them. That's right. He only played one. He only started one hundred and twelve of those games. <laughs> Still, he was a college football All American, first team All Big Ten, and the second team All Big Ten. I mean, seriously, this has got. I think Joe Burrow is going to be relieved. Once this guy comes in, because they're in the because they have because the Bengals they have the fifth pick in the draft, and I'm pretty sure they're going to use it on Penny Sowell from Oregon. Combine Penny with Riley, and you're going to be and Joe Burrow is going to be a huge threat. <laughs> that is, if he can get as that's if the Bengals can give him any decent wide receivers after AJ Green left. Anyways, good luck. With Cincinnati, Riley Reef, and I'll see you all when I bring you even more breaking news. Better pray you guys get Kenny Galladay now.